British Tech International 2012 with Edward Emder, the President of ASIS International. Edward, the recent European Security Conference was a great success. What are your reflections on the event? I think you're right. I cherish uh, the memories already. Uh, we had a huge turnout, uh, more than 500 people in attendance, and then of course our speakers and some honorary guests. Uh, very special events, uh, something the chapter organized even at the House of Lords, but also our reception, all these things very memorable. But in the end it's all about the content and about the quality we deliver. And I think uh, we've been very consistent in delivering top quality speakers and, uh, and subjects that people liked. Uh, I've got that feedback from many, many members and as well as uh, non-members who attended. And I think it was a very... Um, uh, very good event and it's actually uh, pressing us to be uh, even more successful next year in Göteborg when we meet there and I would like to see many people there also from the UK chapter of course there were many there uh, many keynote speakers from the UK but I hope that this will be a consistent thing for us in Europe and um, as you know I'm a European president the first in ASES to be from Europe and actually from outside of North America so also that was a great pride of, of having such a successful uh, event in London and uh, have so many UK people uh, help us establish that. And looking ahead, Edward, what are the main focal points for ACES do you believe in the next six months? Well, we have some consistency, of course, in our programs. We have things we are running. Uh, on the other hand, uh, personally, I'm looking forward to Philadelphia. I really want that to be a big thing. That's my personal goal, so to speak, uh, as, as a volunteer and this year's president. On the other hand, uh, also getting as, as, you know, as large as number we, we can have from Europe attending Philadelphia uh, mid-September. Uh, so I would like to invite uh, members and non-members alike to join us there. We have some other programs. I'm traveling a lot. I'll be celebrating the anniversary, 25-year anniversary in New Zealand, also touching on Australia, South Korea, Japan, Singapore. I'm, I'm really honored and delighted to, to meet many members, not all of our members are traveling all the time. We have people restricted in what they can do in terms of budget or their remit. And uh, it's really fun to meet people. Uh, ASCS is an organization that attracts people that stay if they, I joke, if they survive the first year because they feel welcome and they feel the value of the $150. It's easy to stay on for life until retirement or someone finds another job. So uh, I'm very happy meeting them. We have other programs going on. And from my home, I have a little studio, so uh, I actually produce some videos to address uh, some special groups. We have the women in security, the young professionals, some other things going on. So actually, the next six months for me are packed. Uh, ASCS presidency is my uh, almost full-time job because I really want to make a difference as the, uh, the first European uh, president for this uh, worldwide organization. And especially with our recent growth to 38,000, I think uh, hopefully we can all work together to uh, keep the quality and improve numbers to reach 40,000 uh, at some point next year and uh, then I'm slightly retired from this role and I look forward to meeting many people celebrating the future for ACS then. Thank you very much Edward.